this is another scheduling thing, and we'll stick on the project broadcast because it's fresh in my mind. If I am talking with um, a customer, and let's say she says, oh, I can't do XYZ right now because I have knee surgery next week. You know, I as, as we finish our conversation, I will schedule a message right then for her to go to her next Tuesday and say, hey, Mary, I'm just checking up on you. How is your knee surgery doing? And I think Androids might have a capability to do that. iPhones do not. But you can use Project Broadcast like that to create that kind of system. I just thought of another one. Can I share this one too? Okay. So um, you may or may not be familiar with Calendly, those who are listening. So that's a way you can schedule, um, you know, appointments, um, sessions, parties, whatever with your clients. And if you are struggling to know what you need to talk about on social media, like you're like, I don't know what my people want to hear, or maybe you want to set up a masterclass, a webinar, and you just are not sure exactly what's going to hit with your people in the industry, if you will, behind the curtain, those things are called pain points, right? What are your ideal clients struggling with so you can talk about them? Well, let's circle this back around to Calendly. In the questions that you ask them, right, name, email, phone number, ask them their pain points. Now, you're not going to say, what are your pain points? But what you are going to say is, let's say I sell skincare. Mary, what's one of your biggest struggles that you have with skincare? She's going to fill it out for you. Or you're going to say, if you had the best skin in the world, how would that make you feel? And she's going to fill that out for you. So let's say you have 10 people come to that webinar or 20 people come to that master class. Calendly will take all of those answers, populate them onto a spreadsheet, and you now have 10 to 20 topics to talk about. You know what your people are interested in. Not to mention the fact that Calendly will also send multiple reminder emails or texts and they will send a follow-up email for you. So if you bring these people to your master class and you wanna invite them to join your program or to purchase your product, in the follow-up email, you could say, Mary, it was so great to have you here today. Here's the link I mentioned at the end of our event tonight. Please let me know what questions you have. I'll be in touch with you. So in one foul swoop of sending someone a Calendly link, you're not only building your email list, your text list because we know social media is a rented platform, right? It could be taken away at any day. You do not own that information. So you are now building your email list, building your phone number list. You're collecting pain points. You're collecting topics to say, hey, would you love to have skin that feels so clear that you can go to the pool without makeup on? You now know this because Mary told you this and it's reminding people, it's following up with them. Um, I mean, I could, I could nerd out even more on Calendly, but those are the systems that you can use in your business.